<clears throat> hello, everybody. Hello, hello, hello. Do a little thing for my Instagram, which I'll delete afterwards. Ooh, my screen is so... Ugh. Swipe up. Now to come join me on Twitch. Wow, my screen looks so dirty. <laughs> Hello! Hi! Hey everybody, look at these badges! They're little Judy coins. <laughs> I'm a, um... I'm gonna I'm show you. I don't think the, I think the emotes are still uh, pending, but y'all can see your little badges, so look at those. Katie Girl, thanks for following. Hi, everybody. Hello. Hi. Hi. Let me finish this, uh, this Twitch swipe up thing. Um... And then I will get, I will come right over here. I will come right over here. Okay, done. Okay. Perfect. Um, I wonder if I could show you. I don't think I can. But yes, the little coins. I don't think my, I don't think the emotes are quite ready yet. Um, I think they're still being, like, approved by the little, uh, the little, uh, what do you call it? <laughs> the, uh, the Twitch. They're still being approved by the Twitch. Let me, let me see if I can. I kind of forget how to, how to, um... What is this going to push if I say show up? Nothing. What is this gonna? Nothing. Let me, can I just add a new, listen. I want you guys to see what is in store. I want you to see. Um, oh my gosh, thanks for the bits, KB Collision. Thanks for the bits. Um, here, let me. Let me see. Thank you for all of your patience and kindness. Thank you. But literally, uh, the person who made them for me just finished making them like 30 minutes to an hour before this. So I just want you to see. Um, I just want you to see what it looks like if I can do that. Uh, browser source, can we do that? And source, that's not what I wanted. Here, wait, can we just do this? Can we just do this? Wait, I wanna, wait, 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 you guys, I promise I know what I'm doing. I don't. <laughs> I don't. Okay. Okay. Wait. Oh, I did want to move that. I want to move this guy. Wait, can you see those? Look at those emotes! Wait, are you seeing that? Are you seeing? You are. You are. You're seeing it. Look at these emotes. There's just me waving. There's Judy with hearts. There's me with the candle. <laughs> We love to see it. Oh my gosh, yes, thank you to whoever gifted Simulated Jess um, a sub while we were offline. Aren't those so cute? Can you not wait? Can you not wait? Okay, I'll take it away. Take it away. Take it away. Take it away. I also feel like this chat needs to be larger. Like, y'all need to be able to actually see what people are saying on here. This is going to be a whole mess for the playback later for folks. Um, okay, see, bent, go, um, go eat. 
Oh my gosh, thanks for the, the cheer. We love to see it charmingly awkward. Um, so anyways, oops, that's not what I wanted. Okay, so anyways, I can't wait. I cannot wait, y'all, for these emotes to be not pending. I actually wasn't expecting um, the person to get it done so quickly, and they did, and I was just like, this is so cute. I love it so much. Um, so that's great. I also, in the, the search for somebody to do those, found somebody to make a banner for my main YouTube channel. Um, so, because <laughs> I've been on YouTube for like three, four years now, and I've, I've never had a banner. So that's going to be cute. You know, I'm just doing all this investing now that people are unsubscribing <laughs> from my channel. Uh, so yeah, yeah, here we are, here we are. But I'm so glad you're all so excited uh, of of all of the the cute little emotes that we got coming. Um, so I don't know. I think I told you all that I would look into playing the uh, Mineral Town game. Um. But I haven't downloaded it or anything yet, so, <laughs> so my apologies, my apologies. Also, oh my gosh, wait, I also didn't show you the, um, the badges, but basically all the badges look the same. They're little coins that have Judy's face on them, and then they change, like, you got the bronze one currently. I don't think anybody has the silver or gold, but you can get silver and gold. Look at you investing in your content and channel. <laughs> in community. Oh my gosh, Simulated Jess, thank you. Wait, that was like a thing, right? Like you, yeah, you gave, you gave bits. I, I'm still learning how the Twitch works, but thank you so much. Um, Shauna, thanks for tuning in while you're shopping. Uh, but yeah, I do want to play Mineral Town because that looks exactly like the kind of game I would love playing. Um, I just haven't had a chance to download it. And today I actually took a half day from work. Um, sometimes I, I start working and it just like, I'm not feeling it. And I asked my boss to let me take a mental health day for the second half. Obviously I'm actually using sick time and things like that. But, um, but yeah, I just wasn't feeling up to anything today. So I took half a day. Judy and I went on a long walk. We cuddled. And now here I am. Ashley Jade says, I loved your video today. It sent me down the rabbit hole. Thank you so much. Also, y'all, after we get done streaming, if you want to go give it another click, give it another like, um, and go check it out, I would love, love for you to do that. Leave some comments on it. Help get it in the algorithm. Um, oh, good. Isabel finished her crossword puzzle. <laughs> we love to see that. I'm so happy for you. Zach, you have 100,000K subscribers again. Well, thank you for letting me know. <laughs> I still don't understand what Randonautica or whatever that app is. Uh, it, I mean, same. Same. <laughs> it's a it's a fascinating app. Ooh, what did Static give me? I know this is kind of out of the blue, but I spotted this piece of furniture the other day and it made me think of you. So I'm sending it your way. I think it'd look real sharp in your place. I hope you like it. Yeah, you know, I've had a little bit of subscriber whiplash. It's really fine. It's just, um, it's just interesting because it's like, Literally, people, every time I post a new video, people, oh, a cushion, a cushion who? Every time I post a new video, people, oh, that is so boring. Um, people find out that, that I am no longer doing Amber Lynn content, even though I posted that video like two weeks ago, three weeks ago, maybe at this point. Well, uh, <laughs> I can't believe you stole a lily of the valley from my island. I swear I didn't, but I want to make it official. So we're going to go talk to Isabel, but we need like a celebration outfit on for when she tells us. Um, I know this is quite the look. 
I know this is quite the look, but we need to celebrate. We need to celebrate. So I want a whole new outfit to celebrate in. I want glamour. I want fashion. Like this bold Aloha shirt. No. I want, ooh, like this career jacket. Or we could go with the, oh, the comedians. Listen, I wouldn't call that a comedian outfit. I think that's just like lovely. I kind of like this though, this Chesterfield coat. Although it's summer. Why would I be wearing a Chesterfield coat? Um, there's always the leopard tee. <laughs> this is always my favorite. It's also my favorite part of the stream. I love the OOTD. You gotta love the OOTD. The skull tee. <laughs> like, who? What? Um, like maybe we should just do a tuxedo jacket. Or this tweed jacket. I just want him to look fancy, you know? <gasps> Drew87, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to your little Judy coin. I hope you enjoy. Like, what could we do with this tweed jacket? Could we get the flashy slacks? No, I don't like that. I don't like it. I, don't. I love a cropped pant with everything, to be quite honest. Like, is, is that, that's it. That, that is the look. We love a cropped pant. We love a cropped pant. Gonna be real sad if it turns out he's still at four stars. I mean, I haven't made any significant changes to my, my island since I saw the Lily of the Valley. So, if something happened, if something changed... I'm going to be so mad. Also, the chat box on this screen is also so small. Let me make that bigger so that, like, people can actually read it, you know? It feels, it feels like you should be able to read that. Okay. Um, okay, great, 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 great. We could just do the instant muscles suit. <laughs> we could. We could. I also, you know, maybe we put on a dress. Maybe it's a dress or this power, power skirt suit. Very Hillary Clinton. No. Or the princess dress. Like, I buy all of these dresses, but I never have my guy wear them. I also love this little suspender outfit. Here, let me go down. Look at the suspender outfit. I went from five stars to four stars, but I don't know what's making my island cluttered. Can anyone explain? I've tried moving furniture and stuff and even taking some away, but it's still too cluttered. I have no idea. <laughs> you clearly saw how long it, I struggled. How long I struggled to get to where I am today. Ooh, a little barrette. A little flashy hairpin. I always love a good halo moment. Should I put the the homemade crown on? Cause I'm the king. <laughs> Cause my island's great. You gotta love the kiwi hat. You gotta love it. You gotta love it. Or we could the paperboy cap, even though it kind of clashes with the the pattern of the jacket. I do love these little guys. These little hats. These little straw hats. The little straw boater. Or just a tiara. I mean, maybe we should do the princess dress. I don't know. I'm not feeling a good hat to go with this. I do want to do the mustache. Why am I feeling inspired to have this mustache on here? Oh, this is the perfect time for the LaBelle hat. The perfect time. Okay, we're gonna, the, the mustache clashes with the LaBelle hat. I love the Kiwi hat, honestly, honestly. <gasps> the Burks were in your store today? I need more. I need more pairs of Birkenstocks. 
Honestly, truly. Um, oh my god, y'all, seeing the um, dog nose reminded me that, I think it was yesterday when I was playing, Felicity gifted me a cat nose. Can you believe? <laughs> I was like, sis, this feels like a lot. Oh, the Chantal shades. I personally like these round shades. Let's just go with the black round shades. And then what kind of shoes? The business shoes? <laughs> the comfy the comfy sandals? Not no, not today. Not today. This is this is a a look that needs not lace up boots. I always wear the lace up boots. I want, I might go with the business shoes or the winkle pickers. Ooh, we could do these, these wing tips. This is a look. This is the look. Now, here's the tea. Do I want, do I have socks that would look good with this? No. No. Maybe. No. Mm-mm. No. 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 I'm, I'm, I'm getting a lot of no's right now. <laughs> this is how I'm feeling. A lot of no's. I kind of like, I kind of like these striped socks. That's kind of a look. Too matchy? <laughs> I, I don't think it's matchy enough. <laughs> Ooh, and then I'm gonna wear my evening bag. I do, we do like an evening bag. Or should I do the faux fur bag? No, the evening bag does it. She's got money. She's got money. She's got money. Wow. Yes. She owns 51% of this island. All right, what? Oh, I love when I get Nook Miles for accessing my wardrobe and changing my look. I love it. Um, okay, great. So we're just gonna knock it out of the park right now and go, Bones, what are you doing? What are you doing in there? Um, oh, Leaf, hello, my dude. We're just gonna go check out a, a woman do carry an evening bag at dinner time. Yes, as the great Bob the Dry Queen once said. Um, she's got style, she's got grace, she's Miss United States. All right, oh, I'm, I hope I, I, of course, did not access this yesterday, cute. Cute. We hate to see it. We absolutely hate to see it. Uh, okay. Oh, I definitely don't have this one. Great. We love KK Aria. Okay. Um, all right. Are y'all ready? Wait, is that from Paris is Burning? Oh, I think Bob, you're probably correct. You're pro Bob the Drag Queen says it in, um... Uh, you are correct. That is from Paris is Burning. Bob the Drag Queen does quote that in, uh, in the song Purse First. I've got 300k Nook Miles, nothing left to buy. I guess that's why I stopped playing. Um, yeah, I mean, I think, like, you gotta find your motivation to play, right? I actually was kind of, I'm kind of nervous about getting this five star rating because, listen, honestly, truly, I was ready to um, do more decorating with y'all on the stream and letting you, you guide me. Thanks for the cheer, Willow Davis. Paris, Ohio is burning. We'll get the Paris, Ohio lookout next. If, if we only have four stars all of a sudden today, Paris, Ohio's coming out. <laughs> all right, so you're curious about the current image of Judith? I surely am. Bum, 
ba 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 Yes! Look at this five stars! Who is she? Who is she? Who is she? <laughs> you absolutely love to see it! It is what you love to see. Also, what is my hair doing? People have been saying they like my hair like this, so get into it. Oh, thank you all so much for the love and support. I really truly do believe it was y'all convincing me to put that stall with the coconuts on the, um, on the beach. <laughs> I truly believe it. Our island has become so popular that people dream about living here. Wow, look at all these emotes! It's an emote party! Yes! Yes! Look at this! Uh, people are dreaming about living on our island. Okay, let's read an excerpt. Number one on the list of islands that snow people want to be born on at least once. Judith. Uh, that's fascinating considering it's the middle of summer, but okay. Okay. Next winter, I want someone who lives on this island to roll me up and give me life. Well, get ready. I used to love... I used to love building the snowmen in the other games. Although in the, the GameCube one, I remember it was really hard. I feel like I struggled. I struggled. <laughs> okay, I struggled. Well, there you have it. Yes, we finally did it. Judith, once a deserted island untouched by civilization earned the best possible ranking. Thank you for all, for all your hard work, Zachary. You were the key to this island's success. Well, damn right. I built this shit. I built it all. I built it all. Every single part of it. <laughs> to commemorate this special achievement, I'm presenting residents with a recipe for... Ooh, a golden watering can. You better send me that data. Anytime now. Anytime now, Isabel. Wow. Look at all that I have achieved. Look at all that I have achieved. You absolutely love to see it. Bum, bum, bum. Wow, look at him. Look at him. Won't he do it? <laughs> oh, yeah, let's go make the golden wa- Ooh, Do I have- You probably need a golden nugget, don't you? Um, ooh, there's the- There's the spot. We'll dig that up. Alright, we have- Plenty to accomplish today. We're gonna do all the chores, and then depending on where we're at after chores, we'll see what all, what other kind of trouble we can get into. What are you doing, Jude? She's sitting behind me on the floor on her blanket. Poppy, what do you want, my dude? Oh, other things that happened this weekend. Um. Fauna gave me her photo, so that was cute. We love to see that. We absolutely do. I forgot to get the uh, the money tree one day or two. Of course, my axe breaks. You hate to see it. I wish gold roses had green stems. Y'all, the, the hybrid flower thing really stresses me out, if I'm going to be honest with you. Riku Rinku, thanks for hosting my stream. Also, thanks to Willow. I think Willow also hosted my stream earlier, so thank you. They write personal notes to me on the back. I have not even read them. We can go look at that. I would like to go check that out. Wow. 
I'll have to go get a gold nugget so we can make a gold watering can for sure. Uh, but I need an axe right now. Should we go read the, the personal notes? Where? How do I access that? Judy, we're not playing this game. She's going to play this game, y'all, where she's like, do I want to be in the studio with Dad or do I want to leave the studio and not be with Dad? It's a very classic Judy move when we're filming and streaming. Very classic Judy move. Ooh, squ Squashy Czar is raiding with a party of three. Welcome. We love to see it. Welcome to the party. Looks at you throwing around the word studio. Well, what I mean, that's like what I call this room. It's just like a room in my apartment. It, studio feels like a lot but like I keep the lights set up in here I keep my tripod set up yeah Willow why are you so critical just got off the phone with Nintendo she's a she's fancy wait so how do well there's fauna but I would I would like to how do I read the back of them? Do I have to analyze the, the photo? I want to see the note. Wait, how do I, how do I read the note? How, I didn't, I had no idea there was a note. Oh, this is a photo of Axel. Huh? There's a message written in small letters on the back of the photograph. Judy, what do you, Judy, what do you, what do you want? Do you want, here, say hi. Say hi to your, say hi to your public. Say hi to your public. <laughs> um, thank you for the compliments on my lovely island. All right, let's see what Axel has to say. Let's see. Let's see. Girl, you are all, you are, you are up here today, huh? Um, please don't lick me. Please, I don't, listen. Listen, please don't lick me. Um, he was born March 23rd. Yes, I remember I missed his birthday because I literally had the game for like two whole days at that point. I feel like he's an Aries. His favorite saying is, do not compare a fly with an elephant. <laughs> Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Tell me. Why would I do that? That's it? All right, I wanna... Let's see what Fauna has to say. There's a message. She's born March 26th. I feel like I might have also missed her birthday. Um, her favorite saying is, the first step is always the hardest. All right, okay. Well, here we are. I did see bit. I did. You missed it. But I did. I got. I got five stars. So I. Oh, this is a photo of Phoebe. What does it say? She's born April twenty second. I didn't miss her birthday. I definitely remember attending. Her favorite saying is, "You can't keep a good bird down." Listen, yes, Phoebe. I love to see that. And then let's see, here's Jacques. I didn't miss his birthday either. It was just, it's the same day actually as my twin nephews. So I remember I did not miss it at all. Um, his favorite saying is, better to have loved and squawked than to never have loved at all. What a romantic, what a romantic. Phoebe is one of my, she was also one of my starters, her and Axel, and I have both of their photos. Didn't promise they'd be riveting messages, only that there would be messages. <laughs> is it that Shakespeare? Probably, probably. Jude, 
Let me just hold, hold my controller without you licking everything. She surely does want to stream. She wants to like is what, what she wants to do. I don't quite understand. She's, I mean, I think it's like a Shih Tzu thing. Um, let's see, I want to get some, a gold nugget out so we can make, so we can make, oh, I didn't realize I had so many gold nuggets. Okay, well, I just want to make, um, I just want to make Jacques Spear. <laughs> oh, it's an Alfred Lord Tennyson quote. Listen, Jacques is sophisticated. Jacques is sophisticated. Okay, let's craft this gold watering can. Wow. What kind of gold uh, crafting things do I have? I have a lot of gold stuff gold DIY recipes and I've never crafted any of them. <gasps> like these boots? This floor? Should I? <gasps> Y'all, I need the golden toilet for my bathroom. I need the golden toilet for my bathroom. We're making it. <laughs> We're making it. <laughs> We're making it. Wow, okay, we gotta go add that to the bathroom. I didn't even realize I had that DIY recipe. Wow, stunning. Let's go add it to the toilet room. <laughs> we are not living like a Kardashian in this house. Not when they're just standing by and letting Kanye do whatever he wants. Mm -mm, not, not today. Not here. Wow, that really just, that really just does it. <laughs> that really just completes the room. What a wild room, y'all. Who gave me the chicken permission? <laughs> I don't... Yes, PSA, don't vote for Kanye. Honestly, I understand the, co I don't get po political often, but I mean, that's not true at all. I do, I absolutely do. Um, let's just be clear that harm reduction is important and no politician is perfect. And you have to vote who has the best interests in mind for the most marginalized communities and who is most likely, who is most likely to respond to pressure being held against them to change, right? And as far as I'm concerned, that's Joe Biden. I think he is most likely to respond the way we would want him to respond to pressure. And no, that's not Kanye. <laughs> that is not Kanye whatsoever. Um, so that that's where I'm at. You're welcome for this political moment <laughs> with me. But do I, do I think Joe Biden is an extremely flawed candidate? I surely do. I surely do. Was not my, was not my first choice, but will be the person I vote for. Also, PSA, please vote in your, your local, your local elections as well. Your, your city mayor is just as important as the president. Just to be clear. <laughs> your senators are just as important as the president. Your, your House of Representative rep that was redundant is, is important. Oh, also, do y'all want a bug off this weekend? The bug off is this weekend, right? We That would be so fun to do again. Like like how we how we did it you know i voted for bernie in the uh in the primary because at that point mine <gasps> did you just see poppy turn into this little cutie look at him he said let me put these glasses on in this shirt he said let me do that thanks for following emily mac
A lady that was already the mayor here, and she stole gift cards from poor people, almost rough. Is it? Aren't politics wild? Aren't they fucking wild? But yeah, the local government's so important. I mean, also want to be clear, I don't stand Lori Lightfoot either. <laughs> like, she's also a very uh, flawed politician um but you know it is what it is i mean she she handled the pandemic better than most elected officials oh look at little phoebe <laughs> gotta get these nook miles this <gasps> This golden milestone. Oh, how do I get the other golden tools? Okay, we need to sell some stuff, get some shit out of my inventory. This cushion, this unfinished. Oh, here's the cat nose that, um, what's her face gave me. Felicity. I don't want a cat nose. I don't want this hula top. What is this? Velvet stool. I don't know what that looks like, so we're not going to get rid of it. Um, great. Great, 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 great. Confirm. Gulliver gives you the golden shovel, I think, after you help him 30 times? 30 times? Zach, did you see Trump's car crash Chris Wallace interview? I honestly have not. I I don't actively seek out listening to him talk directly these days. Judy, what are you doing? What'd you find back there? What'd you find? Our governor is Republican and he doesn't take shit from Trump and that's why Maryland doesn't have a damn outbreak again because he bought a lot of masks from South Korea. I mean, truly, I, I, I mean, Illinois is struggling, but not nearly as bad as these other places that just like did whatever the fuck they wanted, <laughs> you know? Uh, I know that like, for instance, Lori Lightfoot just rolled back some things in terms of, um, what's allowed and specifically in Chicago because to be quite honest a lot of times like Chicago has different expectations than the rest of the uh the state because you know there's a lot more like the population is much more dense here <gasps> what is this little houndstooth thing in the window I love the bit where Chris Wallace said he'd taken the test Trump keeps bragging about and it was easy. <laughs> yeah. Oh! Oh, wow. What? This hat. This hat. All right. Let's get in here. Let's get into the changing booth. Oh, we love a bowling shirt. Can I tell you, when I was, like, probably in middle school, I wanted a pair of bowling shoes just to wear out into the real world every day so badly. Okay, I'm probably going to get a bowling shirt. And by probably, I mean, I'm pretty sure I am. Do we need some three-quarter sweatpants? I'm wearing sweatpants today. This, this houndstooth thing. Y'all, I love this. Actually, I think I'm going to keep wearing it. I think this is the move. The, look at this outfit that she has on right now. Look at this. Remember the Anderson Cooper Trump family interview when Anderson Cooper asked, was asking Ivanka a question and Melania was just like, hello. Yes, I love that because um, I love all the TikToks and stuff about it. I do want this samurai helmet, but I want to wear this dress out. Do we need different socks, do you think? Not that. No. Mm -mm. I don't I don't think. Are there any new shoes here that I might want? Or should I leave? 
I have some strappy heels already. I don't, I don't need those. I love this look. We're gonna wear it out. Leggings. Denver Public Schools just announced they would start the year remotely, so that's good for my neck of the woods. I am only gonna hope that <laughs> that schools will will take their own direction in doing that. Um, I would like to buy it. I I probably should have just gone back into the. I want the bowling shirt. I just don't want to go back into the, the, all the way back into the changing room because I'm lazy. Um, I'm really hoping that, but I mean, I work at a university and even at the university, we're trying to do hybrid classes and it's possible that I might have to physically go into work one day a week. So there's that, but it is what it is. Not the end of the world. Life will go on. My shovel? You really gonna give me the end of my shovel? I think my main concern with going in at this point is like, I think my school will do everything it needs to do to keep things safe, but like, I'm gonna have to take, I don't have a car or anything, and I, my only option for transportation is thus then, uh, the CTA? With the Chicago Transit Authority. And that's very stressful as a concept to me. Are you telling me I don't have the resources to make a freaking... I might have to go. I forget even what I need for the, the shovel. What, what do I not have? Hardwood. I hate hardwood. Oops, that's not the, the axe I want. All right. All right, boys. Give me the hardwood. I only want hardwood. Give it to me. <laughs> that's what I said. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah, I think it's also like, I literally was, I don't think you'd ever watch my streams, but I like got into a disagreement with my friend today because he literally was like, I'm doing all the precautions every time I go outside and I'm just like, okay, but like also don't, like you don't have to go to the bar, you don't have like, some of us are gonna be forced to go to work at some point and would rather not at all. And like, then we have to go interact with people that potentially have been out at all these bars. <sighs> Where's the hard one? Who's my favorite villager? Um, it definitely changes depending on the day, but it's certainly probably Felicity, followed closely by Jacques. I mean, they're definitely my top two. At least your teacher's union isn't having to sue the state because they are forcing schools to open five days a week face to face because Florida is. Florida is its own beast. I, woo. To think I applied to jobs to work there at one point after grad school. I can't even imagine now. I have a friend that works and lives there though. And I have a friend that's originally from there, but she no longer lives there. Um, okay, do I have, I hope I have enough wood now. Okay, I was like gonna say. Apparently the bar pub is one of the highest risk activities. Absolutely, I mean, think about those places. Like, people are drinking, people are not being thoughtful. Like, even if you say that you're following all of the precautions and everything, like, I don't believe that you're, you're gonna be able to stay 100% free. Cause like, I, I know me when I've had a few drinks, I'm, <laughs> I'm careless. I do stuff I wouldn't, like, 
you know, I don't know. So I'm gonna I'm gonna stop complaining about it. Um, I wouldn't be surprised though if like if they try some ish with Chicago public schools like I wouldn't be surprised if the teachers union didn't like revolt because I mean we literally just last year just last year the teachers were striking at the beginning of the year um like they really I really love that about the Chicago teachers union like they really do advocate for themselves and like as a person in education i love that for them um and yeah what was i gonna say about that oh and so like i i'm sure if they try to pull some ish that the chicago teachers union is not gonna be about it quite truly following all precautions means not going to the bar in the first place that's what that's exactly what i told him i'm gonna be honest with you <laughs> that's exactly what i said because i was just like you could avoid all of this by just not just not going you know but yeah the the reason i had this conversation with them today is because the chicago rolled back so they were letting people indoors at bars and they just rolled back that and they're no longer allowed to do indoor bars anymore so it has to go back to like only being bars that have patios and stuff like that i don't want to rock okay let's go assess these fossils because i'm gonna give the oh does he have fleas i didn't even notice i'm i'm the worst okay brie i will i will i will take care of him i will take care of him But yeah, I totally agree, like, listen, just because the government says we can do something doesn't mean that we should, especially if, like, we know better, <laughs> we know that that's, like, not servicing, like, the most marginalized people. Because the other thing I tried to say to him is, like, okay, cool, like, you can go wear your mask, but, like, a lot of these people working at at these bars, restaurants, etc., like, don't have a choice. Like, they need to keep their jobs, so they have to keep going to, to work every day. And, like, some of them may be living with, with folks with, um, um, immune compromised systems. Thanks for subscribing, Ashley J8155. We love to see it. Wow, I, um, I honestly feel like I've talked way more about, uh, like, I don't know, current events than I typically do, but that's, like, one thing that I have really reflected on post giving up Amber Lynn content, to be quite honest with you. I think, like, one thing that really, um, was a challenge about my channel is that like and one of the reasons I kept making Amberlynn content was that I was very concerned about keeping my subscribers and my base and I was I was always worried about speaking too much about politics which is just like very unlike me in my real personal life um I very much talk about those things and so giving that giving up like subscribers anyways because i gave up making that kind of content just made me realize like moving forward like this channel's going to reflect me my personal values my personal beliefs uh and and who i am in real life not that it didn't reflect me because i think it very much did in a lot of ways but like I was keeping that stuff for my channel. Even when I made that silly video reacting to a Bernie Sanders video, I was being so, uh, <laughs> so non-confrontational about it. Not that you need to be confrontational. I really want to say cross-legged, but I can't get my, okay. <laughs> um, so yeah, you know, I mean, I, I don't, I don't, I'm not going to turn into a channel that's like, commenting about you know like the the presidential race by any means because i don't think that i know enough about those things to do that but but 
Um, I'm certainly not going to shy away from posting on Twitter and Instagram about, like, Black Lives Matter, about, like, supporting black trans people, because those people can't afford for privileged white people like me to, to not say something, right? So that's kind of where I'm at with that. But I, it, it is really freeing. Once people say, hey, I'm going to leave your channel because I don't like your content, it's really freeing to say, like, okay, well, then I'm going to do content that I like. <laughs> like, it's been, it's been really cute. It's been real cute. Real cute. Ashley said, I think you're a fantastic creator and you've helped me so much during this crucial time. Thank you so much for saying that. I really appreciate it. Oh my gosh. And then Zay Rowan also said, we see in your current content, Zach. Thank you. Thank you. Ugh. I really, like, I think one thing, I mean, if I'm being, like, super transparent that I've been struggling with is, like, not struggling with, that's not the right word, but what I've been trying to focus on and remind myself is that, like, what matters is the the people who are showing up to, to support me. And I literally got into a... a not an argument, but like a back and forth with a person on a, in a comment on today's video who was like, clearly they just wanted to like try to give me some kind of, um, they wanted to get a reaction out of me, which I guess I probably ended up giving them. Um, and then I realized like this is one comment in a sea of comments on this video of people who are saying that they, they love this new content, that they're enjoying it. And so coming back to that, like, I mean, that's advice that I've given to people like Chantal and Amberlynn, right? Like I've told them, y'all, like focus on the people who are coming to your channel and are saying that they support you and that they like you and that they enjoy what you're doing. And so that's the attitude I'm going to try to keep, you know, you feel me? Okay, we're going to go give these presents out to people. Because Mama needs some more photos. Getting away from Amberlynn content has been like trying to leave a cult. I mean, I feel like you and I talked about this earlier today, Willow, but I, yeah, I, I agree. <laughs> it's so weird because like, I feel like I also have to just like constantly keep reminding people that I'm not doing it, um, which is also okay. It's fine. But it, it does, like, I, I, I wanted to just make, like, a clean cut and was not able to do that clearly because we're still here talking about it. <laughs> we're still here. Um, I enjoy your reacts. To be honest, I never subscribed to you or Willow for re reacts. I found you by chance because Amber kept popping up on my recommended for whatever reason. Uh, but you love Real Housewives, and I do too, and I appreciate a content creator who makes niche references like Chicken Permission and Eggs à la Francais. <laughs> I found you randomly towards the end of Amberlynn stuff, and I never watched her. You were just in my recommended. I love that you're doing your own interest now. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't know, even know Amberlynn was a, still a thing until Zach made her relevant again. I don't, I mean, I don't think I single-handedly made her relevant, but I think some folks, um, I think, like, the reaction community certainly keep her going. Uh, and I think one thing that, like, I want to continue to say is, like, even if I was not, um, even if I was not being personally, like, mean or rude to her, because uh, I really believe that, um, I feel like, I mean, I certainly was one of the first people to make content like that, and I feel like I really opened it up for all kinds of people to come in here and do X, Y, Z things and, like, say things that were far worse, and I know there are a number of people who felt like I should have said more about, like, the things that Charlie Gold was saying, and, like, I mean, all I can say is, like, I have said those things to Charlie Gold, like, privately <laughs> and publicly, and so it's just like, I think that that's why I was just like, I gotta like make the cut, acknowledge what I'm responsible for, which is like even starting to make this kind of content to begin with and then like move on, you know?
All right, I gave you this fossil. Thank you so much. I, I don't want a jockey uniform and I'm pretty sure I've given you a jockey uniform because I thought it was funny to give a horse a jockey uniform, but here we are. Anyways, I feel like now I've like talked about her a shit ton and that's really also still not my 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 game, my plan. Oh, somebody kept saying, I think Bree kept saying like, go take care of Bones, go help Bones. He was down here earlier, right? Bones, where are you? Oh, he, he definitely does have fleas. And then we'll, we'll, We'll get him with the, um, we'll get him with the, uh, the fossil here in a second. Whoa, there was a flea crawling on me? Yuck! <laughs> uh, fleas are the only gross bugs. Well, yip, yip, it's gone now. Fake Zachary, you're my hero. All right. Oh, I didn't mean to hit you! Oh, let me give you a gift. <laughs> let me give you a gift. Let me get you a gift. Let me do that for ya. Um, with all of that being said, if you really, wait, get up. I wanna give you a gift. All right, thank you. Um, we gotta make you happy, I feel bad. With all that being said, if you do like the new content, make sure to, to like it and comment. Um, I think both Willow and I have been vocal about that recently, but it, it helps get things back in the algorithm. If you want to click on the video a few different times, I think I'm allowed to tell you to go watch my videos, right? Like that feels like that's permissible. I know there's certainly more important things <laughs> in the world than um, than what Zachary Michael is making on the YouTube, um, but I would I would love to do it. Like love to to have your support even more than what y'all are already giving me, which I am very grateful for. Just to be clear. All right, Bones. A cartoonist set. I don't need that. I accidentally tried to catch Wisp last night and he turned around and said, you do know I'm not a spirit piece, right? <laughs> I feel like whenever he's all like separated, he does look like the other little spirit pieces. I feel like that's an honest mistake, my friend. An honest mistake. Ooh, let's go get this DIY, which I'm sure I already have. Please no more creamed corn though. Uh, you have my word that I won't do any more creamed corn. I already know this. <sighs> the DIYs on the beach and what the other villagers are doing are so annoying. Oh, I love her in this shirt. Look at Felicity with her, her orange fago. Do y'all love the insane clown posse or know anything about them? You don't have to love them, but do y'all know anything about them? And juggalos and juggalettes. I was just thinking about you. Hi there, my fabulous bestie. If we're besties, then you better give me this photo. Okay? You keep calling me bestie, but I don't think you know what that means. What could it be? I'm going to sing while I open it. I love how she's holding this whole ass fossil with her drink all at once. I don't want a jumper work suit. I want your picture, girl. Kitty Lovely, thank you so much for the, me the highlighted message. I love you as well. Thank you so much. Um, the, <laughs> I just love, there's, I think it's, I think we watched it on Vimeo. Um, this is going back to the Insane Clown Posse. I know I got distracted for a second. Um, I think I watched it on Vimeo, but there's like a little documentary called American Juggalo. It is so fascinating. It's about their, their little event called The Gathering. 
that happens, I think, maybe in the middle of nowhere Indiana, maybe middle of nowhere Illinois. I'm not actually entirely sure. Maybe Ohio. Um, like, look at all these flowers. I really have to do something about all of that. Uh, I was hoping Judy would be here, but she is not. She's not home right now, so we're gonna have to go find her elsewhere. Um, oh, there's another fossil. How many fossils are you supposed to get a day? I feel like I already found the minimum for today. You and Willow Davis should play Ooblets. I would like to, actually. I've seen some other people playing it, but I, for now, when it comes to streaming stuff, or really any video games, I gotta stick to Switch and it's not currently available on Switch. Although, what did they announce it? What was announced on the Nintendo Direct today? Was it anything exciting? If you gift villagers iron wall lamps, you get more friend points and get their pick faster. You have to craft them, but it's worth it. Is that is that true? I mean, I'll go craft one now. Who else do I have left? I have Pancetti, Judy, and Static to give some gifts to. Wall hanging items won't show up in their home, so it won't mess up the vibes. I mean, I'm not concerned about messing up the vibes, especially for the ones that, like, don't have the homes that, um, the interiors that they're supposed to have. You know what I mean? But I'll try it. Sure, let's let's go for it. Think slightly better for the, the suggestion. I'll give that to somebody. Somebody come get her. She's dancing like a stripper. Hey. Let's see. Let's go give Static a gift. I read they have a max number of furniture, so you... So if you get too many wall items, they start getting ri Oh! Oh! Oh, I've already given him a, an iron wall thing, I think. Hey. Careful where you're going, okay? Don't be knocking all my stuff over. Give me, give me this, give me this DIY, a dark bamboo rug. Okay, I might not have that. I might not. Okay. I don't have it. I don't have it. Alright, well, he's not giving the iron wall lamp anyways right now, because I already got this present wrapped. <gasps> Why would you do that? Why would you do that? I just... Full on wasted. I just full on wasted that that present wrapping. Now I'm now I feel like I gotta go get more wrapping paper. <laughs> uh, so rude. And by rude I mean me. I'm like so stupid. So dumb. So silly. A little goofy goober. Can I sell some of this other stuff I don't want? Oh, there's Judy! My little angel. My little nugget. Um, okay, let's just get some wrapping paper. We need the memorial emoji for that wrapping paper. We do. Oh, I wish it was here. I wish we had it. I wish we did. Soon. It'll come soon. It'll come soon. Next stream, hopefully. All right. Let's see. Judy? Gonna wrap up. Uh, let's give her the iron wall lamp and see what she does. She's so precious. She's seriously so precious. Have I checked the turnips? I haven't. 
I, I never think about it because I I must be dreaming. This can't be an iron wall lamp. How did you know I've been wanting one of these? A traditional tea set. Interesting. At least it's not clothing. All right. Let's, I'll check the turnips for you. Ooh, 128. That feels good. That feels real good. That feels nice. That feels nice. That feels like what you would want it to be. Jumper work suit, don't need. Green grass skirt, DIY, don't need. Jock uniform, don't need. Flea, don't need. Cartoonist set, don't need. This extra rock, don't need. Is that it? Oh, what's this guy? Oh, wait, I do want the samurai helmet. I'm so sick of my villagers giving me clothing. They all have vile taste. Agreed. But I do feel bad sometimes because I'm like, I think some of this I've probably gifted y'all. So it's like, mm, can I really complain right now? Can I? But yeah, generally it's all ugly. Generally I'm just like, this is stupid. Get out of here. All right. Let's wrap up these fossils. Because we're going to give them to Pancetti and Static. Let's go, let's go. Why did I go into the Abel Sisters? What am I doing? I've really lost the plot. I've really lost it. Is the hollow taco as pretty as it looks on YouTube? It sure is. I actually just um, ordered the anniversary, the anniversary set. I haven't painted my nails actually in a while though. They're they're just boring and ugly right now. But once I once I get those, I plan on I plan on painting again. Yes, I love that all of y'all love the hollow taco in here. I simp for simply nail logical. Take this present that's wrapped. Give me your picture. Hey, hey, wonder what it is. I'm excited to open it. Ooh, an ammonite? Yeah. What a splendiferous relic. I'll gladly take it off your hands. Thanks, Kurtz. I don't want any, I don't, I have like two vertical striped shirts already. I need a remix of the Skylar Sisters for the Able Sisters. Work, work, Sable. Work, work, LaBelle and Mabel. The Able Sisters. Daddy said to be home by sundown. Daddy doesn't need to know. Hi, Panchetti girl. Well, hello there, Skippy. Sit down, stay a while, make yourself at home. Do you want this? Can't wait to see what's inside. Well, <sighs> okay. MLM, babe. Boss, babe. Give me your photo, babe. Here, take this shorts outfit. I've got a lot of questions. We're gonna check this out. What is this shorts outfit? Why do I already know I'm gonna hate it? This is exactly the kind of nonsense that an MLM, um, an MLM boss babe would do. I would give her something real nice and she'd be like, here, try my, try a sample of my Jamberry nails. Try my, Try my It Works wraps. 
Try my shorts outfit. It's her Lula Row shorts outfit. It acts Panchetti. <laughs> Panchetti. Miss me with this Lula Row nonsense. <laughs> look, look at this Lula Row nonsense. You absolutely hate to see it. I'm so mad. I'm so mad that she had the audacity. I'm. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Wow. Can you can you can y'all believe? Oh, they're shock. Look at this little cutie. He's fishing. You know what they say about fishing, right? Well please tell me, because I can't catch anything. Wow. Shock. You're my favorite. No, Felicity is. Well, currently, since I talked to you most recently, it's you. It's you, Jacques. You have my heart. You have my love. You have my everything. You have my world. Okay, I need to go get the, the money rock, because I haven't done that yet. We gotta see what we can do. That's not it. Miss me with that. Let's see what's over here. Let's see. What do we got here? Miss me with that. I just like can't even be bothered by the resources right now. Ooh, can I just, ooh, ooh. We love this fence conveniently being here now. Nope, miss me with that. You're really gonna make me go all the way up here to this one rock that's all the way up here. I also need to do more fishing and stuff. Also, I hate when the, the flowers grow in the path. That's the one, the one thing I will clean up because I just think it looks so bad. I'll probably just sell those lilies. All right, okay. Here we go. Give me these, give me this money. We are in the money. We are in the money. Here we go, here we go, here we go again. Wow, that was anticlimactic. <laughs> anticlimactic. I hate that word. I always try to say it too, and, and I never say it right. I absolutely don't think I've ever said it correctly. Um, okay. Wow, cute, cute. Well guys, I think that's gonna be, wait. Switch to tile or stone and they won't grow. Yeah, I probably do need to do that. My friend just became a beauty counter consultant. Is that an MLM? I've seen that and I think it is. I have to do some more research because I've seen a number of people do it, but it seems very boss baby, you know? And not boss baby like the movie, but just like, you know. Um, yeah, cute work. Let's go get this. We love to, we love to claim our Nook Miles. Uh, but anyways, I think that's probably where I'm gonna end it for this evening. I had so much fun. This was really so helpful. I had like such a weird day with my mental health. So this was really helpful. I love coming and spending time with y'all here. I'm glad that we have this little community. It's, I've talked with Willow about this, but like the people who show up for Twitch streams is just like such a different little community than what like I even would get in like the big like YouTube react streams that I would do. Um, so I just like really appreciate all of you. You all are really just like such a, a fun, um, a fun little place for me to hide away to. Um, so thank you so much. I hope you all have 
a lovely evening. Enjoy your Monday as best as you can. And I will, um, I'll see you all next time.